Hey everybody, the Bong is back. Welcome to part 18 of Let's Play Final Fantasy 3 for the NES. This is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. If you saw in the last part, we heard that Goldor chained my ship. I mean, look, this is as far as I can go, unfortunately. And now that we got the floating shoes, we can go to his mansion and we'll get him to get my ship back. Because I need to go around. And we had to get the floating shoes, because if we didn't have them, we would fall into the swamp and die. Yeah, that's instant death down there. And that's no good. There's a little Vulcan there. There's actually a pallet swap of the salamander. But thanks to Retro's two claws and a pretty good skill rating, he went down in one hit. Oh, we got ourselves a little desert to go across. I believe there's a chocobo forest over here as well. There it is. Just in case we want to dump some items, go over to this spot. There we go. Okay, I'm going to do an in-game save. I'm at level 23, which I consider pretty good for this fight. Oh, I recognize this music. That's the music you would hear if you got a crystal. So it looks like Goldor might have the Crystal of Earth. One would hope, right? There's only one way to find out. Yeah, what the hell, I'll just let Pi use magic. Uh, freezing. Why not? Ooh, break. That's not good. Better end this battle fast. Hopefully Maxwell can finish this bear off. Oh, ineffective. Uh, I'm not gonna bother with Soft because I'm pretty sure Pi will recover in time. Before turning into stone. See? I usually like, save the stop for like, desperate situations. Okay, I see four doors over there, but only one of them takes you somewhere. The other three are dead ends. This one over here is actually a treasure trove. Ah, oh, what the hell, let's turbo this. There. It's always nice to get Noofy some HP back. Every time you use that blood sword. It's not as potent as the one in Final Fantasy 2, but who's complaining? Alright, here's a new enemy here. This one's called the Gold Knight. And I think we'll use some magic. And probably a cure. There we go. There, perfect. Okay. Barring any other battles, let's see what treasures Goldar got laying around. No, not Goldar from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, Goldor. There's a difference. Okay, that battle was out of the way, let's continue. Ooh, a lot of treasures here. Ooh, a shiny sword. Alright, why don't we go over and equip it? Take off the king's sword and put on the shiny sword. Oh! That's helpful! It's, it's just a shiny sword, it's useless! Look at it, it's all shiny swords! What does he need all that for? No wonder his knights suck, all he got is shiny swords! Ooh, and a dragon claw. That's always nice. Get rid of the Kaiser Claws at 102. 114! Perfect. Okay, I'll meet you back at the main floor. Okay, I'm back. Like I said before, out of these four rooms, three of them are dead ends. This one is the one you gotta go to. So let's get ourselves a magic key. Unlocked! Perfect. Aww. Okay, here's a new enemy. This one's a gold warrior. That's pretty neato, if I say so myself. How to swap a berserker. Uh, let's use cure. And uh, Maxwell, of course. Ran into a scuffle with gold bears. That's why his HP is semi-low. Well, lower than maximum, anyway. Oh, only three hits? That's lame. I still gotta upgrade my skill level. 
probably would have done a lot more if he was a fighter. But then again, probably wouldn't be able to equip so much strong weapons. I mean, why would you go with a fighter if you can go with a knight, am I right? Yeah, that's right, I rhyme. Take that, Mother Goose. Fuck you, Mother Goose. Okay, we're getting up a little bit higher. Okay. Rather than go around all that, let's take a shortcut. That's right, I went there. All that walked away and I skipped it. Because I'm hardcore. <laughs> ah. Okay, we're going up a little bit higher, and there's Goldor. Alright, let's heal up. Uh, standard potions will do. Yeah, I think that's it. I think everyone's ready to go. Yeah, you got the Crystal of Earth, too. How about that? That Crystal of Earth is mine now. I won't let you have my crystal. Die! Ugh, someone's a little violent. Okay, this here is Goldor. He got a high magic defense, but a low physical defense. I think I'm going to try to build up at least once. Do not use it more than twice in a row, or you will pay the price. Trust me, you will pay the price. Um... Well, since physical attacks on Maxwell aren't exactly that great, I'll use Ice 3 anyway. And I'll probably use Cure, just in case I run into a scuffle. I was better off using Cure, cure too. Well, that's not a lot of damage. That's not good. And Goldor can use the heavy magic too. Be careful. Fire two. Oh shit! Oh dear Christ! Oh my God! Ugh, cure two. Use it high. Nice! Critical hit, too! Okay, so Goldor can use physical attacks, too. I thought he used just magic. Either way, you better stick to healing pretty fast. Or you're screwed. Use another Ice 3. I'm not gonna bother with Break. Chances are he's immune to it. Uh, let's see how he's doing. Um, no, I'm not gonna bother with that route. I think I'm going to use one of my items. I think I'll use a North Wind. Let's see how that works. Jesus! Oh my god! Oh my god, oh, my character's almost dead! That was just one attack! Oh my god. Okay. Okay, I... Okay, this is pretty much condition critical here. I don't have a life spell, unfortunately. So I pretty much gotta win this now. Ouch! Oh my god. God, Goldor hurts you a lot! I underestimated that cunt. Come on. Got him! Oh, that was close. Ho oh. ho ho! That was actually my toughest boss battle so far. Damn you! I'd rather do this than let you get your filthy hands on my crystal. Hey, what are you doing? Dude, you just destroyed the crystal! Ah! You broke the crystal! I'll never give you the crystal! <laughs> but he's dead, right? Okay, I got a key. It's a locked at Goldor's chain. When touched, it vanished into thin air. The chain is released, but the crystal's in pieces. What will we do? -na 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 -na. Great, so now I gotta walk back manually. Oh, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I'm all rested. I got my characters to level 24 on the way back. And I heard from one of the guys in town that apparently there's a big airship in a big city called Salonia. And I think that's where we're gonna head right now. Why not? Go see Salonia. 
It's a very large walled city. Oh yeah, and I sold those shiny swords too. They were like 2,500 bucks each. And with 11, that's like 27,500. Now that's what I call a bargain, babies. Okay, where is this Salonia? Okay, let's fly around for a little bit. Now, before I progress any further, I'm gonna tell you something. These are the statues of the quest right here. You cannot go through them right now. Watch what happens. You get repelled back. And if you went there on foot, you die! Instantly! That is why you gotta make sure you get all four of those fangs, because yes, that's what the fangs are for. They're for dispelling the statues. So with that in mind, let's find Salonia. It's gotta be somewhere around here. You know what, I'm having a hard time finding it. Why don't I just use sight right now? Alright, Pi, be my eyes. Okay, that, uh, art, the tower over there to the east, that's the Tower of Silks. That's our last destination. Well, one of the last destinations. More on that much, 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 much later in the game. Ah, oh, there's Salonia right here. Actually, before we go to Salonia, why don't we head to the northwest? I heard there's a little town there. That's the town we want to go to first. If I can get there, of course. It's a cave. Like, northwest of here, there's a town called Leprid or something. I believe that's it over here. That's where I want to go first. We'll go to Salonia much later. Yeah, a ba basically, this is a town more for, like, call magic. That's if you had a conjurer. That's the kind of magic you'd want. But we don't have one, so I might get some call magic, but probably just stockpile it for later. I'm gonna stop the video right here. Next part, we're actually gonna go shopping in Leopard and see what we can find. See ya, everyone.